hey guys uh, so today we are going to do a small video on uh, you know the parts of the flower so it's a pretty easy uh, you know thing to remember if you remember the diagram of a flower so what I've done is I've basically taken uh, you know a diagram of flower and I have marked a few labels here uh, so you can typically classify the flower into you know three parts one is the the external or outer part of the flower uh, one is the uh, you know the male part of the flower and the other is the female part of the flower so let's quickly start off with the you know external part it's the easiest to remember so you know the bright colorful uh, you know like smooth part of the flower which you know makes it like really attractive uh, is basically the petal and you will see the petal stands on a greenish uh, a leaf like structure which is the sepal so petal and sepal they basically form the external part of the flower right it comprises of your petal and sepal uh, then going ahead, we'll quickly cover the male part of the flower. So, you know, this structure that you see here, you know, this uh, thing here, it's it's basically uh, a, a, a part that, you, you know, you will see a lot of yellow powder on if you closely notice a, a flower. So that is basically the anther or it's also called the pollen boxes, you know, since that, that yellow powder is called pollen. So I will write this as anther right and the anther is supported on a stem or a stick like structure so that is the filament and together the anther and the filament frame the male part of the flower right and once so you first we understood you know the external part which is which comprises of the petal and the sepal and now we you know completed the male part of the flower which is basically the anther or the pollen boxes which is supported on the filament now you will see there's a, a central uh, structure here okay so this this top part that you see here right which is sort of slightly bulged out is the stigma right okay so and below the stigma this 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 has actually not been labeled here so I label it myself. Uh, this part actually thins out over here. So this is the style. You know the, the part where the the uh, below this stigma where it sort of thins out is your style. And then you have the the main central part of of you know this this area here, which is sort of in a in egg like shape. And this is the ovary now the ovary contains egg cells inside this uh, so which is this basically here you will find egg cells and these egg cells are called ovules and come and if you put together this entire structure you know with starting off with the stigma then you have the style you have the ovary then and the ovules this constitutes the female part of the flower so you know if you, if you, you what now you should do is you should just pick up any flower around you you can pick up a lily or your or you know a rose and you can start observing uh, all these parts of the of the flower and understand the concept really well i'm pretty sure that will also help you in remembering all the names properly thank you